Hello friends, today we are doing unboxing and a review, maybe just unboxing, for the 80 volt max brushless cobalt hedge trimmer. This is just the tool, doesn't come with a battery. I purchased it because I needed to cut some uh, uh, thin branches or uh, shrubs that are coming on top of my backyard fence from the area behind my fence there is like a parking lot and it's a uh, some trees in between um, so this has been very useful I've used one before and this is a new one I just opened it to make sure it's good I bought it like five months ago or three or four months ago in July today is November um, the item number this is of course cobalt from Lowe's uh, the item number is 0828976 again 082976 I will leave a link to the, the item uh, in the description to Lowe's.com this was a hundred dollars I think um, with the free shipping so I thought it was good all right let's go ahead and open it take it out this is a 26 inch I think does it say that anywhere I think it's 26 inch uh, long blade Okay, so it comes with user's manual and that's just a return label if you want to return it. That's it, there is nothing else left in there. Alright, so there it is. Let's see what you can see. 26 inch, yes. So this is 26 inch long and I think these openings can cut up to like uh, three quarters of an inch uh, shrubs they can still cut them so basically when you turn it on these blades go back and forth and you move it this way while they're going back and forth and it catches things in between and it cuts them this is of course just a cover um, the battery goes in here and that's the how it looks like so let's see if you can see it so this can be used like this or if you would like to turn it to cut sideways you can turn the handle like this or like this if you want to go up and down this side or this other side you know so it's very versatile and then you can you leave it in the mid middle position the standard position um, these buttons here I think you press left or right whichever and then you press this button to turn it on so you press like that and you you know left or right doesn't matter just a place for this to get pressed That's all it is, just one piece, you know, nothing to assemble. You just insert the battery in it and use it. All right, if you have any questions, I think this has a five year warranty for the tool. Five year warranty is pretty good from Cobalt. And I hear they have a ha uh, hassle uh, free warranty. So I haven't used it, but hopefully not use it. All right, I'm going to leave a link to it in the description below. If you have any questions, you can leave them in there and then I'll in the comment and then I will get back to you. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Hit the like button if you like this video and found it useful. Until next time, cheers. Hello friends, welcome back. Um, so the initial video you just saw that was two and a half years ago and since then I've used this tool uh, several times each summer so you can see the blade is no longer brand new like it was in the video there um, it's been great um, I like it 
So today I'm gonna use it to trim what I mentioned in that video is the uh, brushes or bushes above my backyard fence which is this thing here you can see how they are on top of my fence by several feet like this one here it's maybe six feet inside of my yard and every year this happens I cut it and it goes back to this here is here in, in the back same thing so that of course is too thick so for this part I may need to use a chainsaw or something else to cut it but first I'm gonna trim the thing here just so much so that's the project today uh, using this tool so I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera on something stable so you can watch me work all right we'll do hyperlapse so maybe a few minutes without hyperlapse and then with hyperlapse okay cool okay here we go Okay, so <clears throat> now we will be doing a hyperlapse, maybe more fun. okay so you can see definite improvement you can see how much i cut here but my arms are sore especially my left arm this this machine is heavy and uh, not heavy but lifting up lifting it up above the shoulders extended period of time trying to balance the machine is not good <laughs> it's hurting my arm okay so I think this is all I can do with this machine. I know I can put a ladder and stuff, but it's not a good idea to use a power tool with a, with a ladder. Um, but you can see it's already better. 
but I'm going to be using maybe next week or the week after I'm gonna be using a pole saw that I bought for this purpose only is I wanted to go behind the fence and cut some of these shrubs down already behind the fence so they don't even get to come here um, but you can see how much I cut there is some here and there's some more on this side <laughs> I don't think they will fit in the uh, yard waste bin and there is some more here here yeah and in the process of doing that I cut one of my beloved lights here uh, <laughs> I hit it with the thing and cut it so I guess now I have a spare bulb <laughs> but yeah I cut it by mistake all right well thank you so much for watching and I just wanted to do a video on this tool uh, show you how it's been holding up I've used it many times and it's good I like it very good tool no gasoline no pulling cord or anything press a button turns on good to go so yeah and it's been two and a half years since I've had it and it's been working great all right well thank you so much for watching the video with me and don't forget to subscribe to the channel until next time i'll see you all in the next video have a nice bit have a nice day okay bye bye